42 days from now, we're going to win Pennsylvania, and we're going to win four more years in the White House. The president is back at the White House this morning, arriving on the South Lawn shortly before 11 last night after addressing a packed audience at Pittsburgh International Airport. In a speech that lasted over 90 minutes, President Trump spoke to a crowd at Atlantic Aviation's hangar in Moon. The president pitched himself as the only choice to restore law and order in America while downplaying concerns over police brutality and social justice. Lisa Washington joins us live this morning with more on what the president wanted to tell the people of Pennsylvania. Lisa. And Heather, this was an energetic crowd that the president spoke to last night. President Trump told this crowd that this upcoming election is important for the economic survival of Pennsylvania. He spoke about a number of different topics to that crowd in Moon Township last night. As you mentioned, the need for law and order. He also spoke about his plans to name a Supreme Court nominee this Saturday. Thousands of people gathered at that hangar in Moon Township to hear from the president. And Mr. Trump sounded very confident about winning the upcoming election and winning Pennsylvania. This was his fourth trip to Pennsylvania this month. He told the crowd that he intended to make America the great manufacturing superpower of the world and reminded them that he saved jobs in Pennsylvania during his first term. This is the most important election in the history of our country. I believe that. And this election is a matter of economic survival for Pennsylvania. Remember, number one in the history of your state last year, and that's because of what we did. We stopped the dumping we saved you steal so many different things, but Pennsylvania is the home of American energy. During that speech last night, the president also criticized his opponent, former Vice President Joe Biden, for wearing a mask and having socially distanced crowds at his campaign rallies. You know, you can't disguise it. You ever see Sleepy Joe with the little circles? He puts them very far away so far away and then he comes up with the mask he's like a hundred yards from the nearest human being he's got a mask the question is will he leave it on during the debate and again those were mr trump's words about his uh, opponent few people in this non socially distant crowd at the hangar last night wore masks the president said there is mounting gop support for his campaign and for his presidency he won pennsylvania in 2016 and says he plans to do it again reporting this morning i'm lisa washington kdka news lisa thank you and joe biden's campaign wasted no time responding to the president stopped our area saying when the president was a candidate he promised to bring jobs back to the reason region but as president now, he has only brought economic turmoil to Western PA. Biden went on to say that he will fight for working families, enact middle class tax cuts and create the jobs Trump promised four years ago.